Which one of you left the toilet seat up? Come on, Titans! The rules clearly state that crypto should not be allowed. I'm Juliano Prado, co-creator of Galinha Pintadinha, the Lottie Dottie Chicken. We are the number one YouTube channel in Brazil, and we make animated videos and music for kids. Follow me, bing bang, boop and bo. We might go to outer space or ride in a truck. We might visit a bar near the chicken club club. We started back in 2006. YouTube was something unknown. It was kind of a happy accident. Me and my partner Marcos, we were figuring out musical clips for kids and we wanted to show it to a broadcaster. So we uploaded to a new platform by the time that was YouTube. But it ended up that we have now 5 billion views. It was not supposed to be like this. <laughs> And I think that we put it on the online environment just in the right moment. We found our audience in this digital medium before everyone else. Our YouTube audience is made of two groups, kids and parents. The kids, we are always thinking about them to make a happy content, a safe content. We're working with traditional songs. They know the songs, their parents know the songs. And I think we make a really strong connection with both of them. Well, YouTube for us was key to our brand. It was just like a survey that we could see if the clips were, were doing well, if uh, they liked it, if they wanted more. And of course, the distribution that YouTube provides, it's something fantastic for a small production that can reach all the country and everybody can talk about it and feedback us with, with their opinions. We found our audience on YouTube, they found us and it's like a relationship. So we keep on listening to each other and that's the way we, we keep to now growing the brand. Today's number is 1.8 billion. That is the number of times YouTube users have viewed Brazil's biggest YouTube star, a blue-spotted hen named Galinha Pintadina, a.k.a. Galinha Pintadinha is based on YouTube. We call it our home. When people think about Galinha Pintadinha, they think about YouTube. We found out that the more we are on YouTube, the more free, the more accessible our content is, the more we can make business and deals with other platforms. Licensing is very time sensitive. You can't start a licensing program if you don't have the awareness for your brand. We figured out this index, this GPPI, Galinha Pintadinha Potential Indicator. We can measure the population of the country and the views so we can see how much awareness we have in each territory. The YouTube platform gives us the exact numbers for each piece of territory that we want to work and we can see it in terms of views and even in terms of quality, content, comments and things like this. The licensing now we have more than 800 uh, different consumer products and we do apparel, uh, toys. In Brazil we have the DVDs, we sold 2 million DVDs. We are on 15 VOD channels, we are on transactional like Google Play, on Netflix, on iTunes and other several VOD channels uh, all over the world. We are looking forward to have the YouTube Kids application all around the world, so I think it's a nature platform for our brand and our content, a very good user experience for, for kids. We have even live shows in Brazil, so it's very powerful for us creators to go to the theater and see a thousand people watching, singing, crying sometimes. It's a real world connection that comes from YouTube and you can drive them to a lot of different experiences. Now we're with almost 5 billion views, more than 5 million views each day. The more free it is on YouTube, the more we can sell it on the other platforms. That's fantastic. And our funds will go to every screen. <laughs>